let's discuss a new simple problem which is finding the lcm of two numbers as we already did in our previous video that is finding the gcd of two numbers we here find the lcm of two numbers so what is lcm basically if i have a two number and if uh, those two number divide a number in in such a way that remainder should be zero and that number should be minimum for example 3 and 7 so which is the smallest number which can be divided by this two number 3 and 7 that is 21 so lcm is a number which least common factor which can be divided by both the numbers and it should be a less number so what will be the approach so problem is very simple we have to find the lcm and there is one formula that into gcd is number uh, multiplication of two numbers so how this formula come into picture like because if any number if we consider six number then there are factors like three into two and if we consider nine then there are factors like three into three so which is a common factor and which is minimum also that is three so three is every every time in in, in both of a number present so 3 is our HCF. So if we look like LCM is nothing but the A into HCF into B into HCF. That means LCM is which is if we consider 9 into 6 uh, or three, 7 into 3 then 21 then here what are the hcf is like 7 into 3 into 7 this is separate number this is separate number so 7 is 7 into 3 that is 21 and 7 is different number so lcm is what which is to be the maximum of divisors coming together and form the number that is our lcm so this is all basic stuff so what is our uh, way or our strategy to find out the lcm is that we have to first find out the gcd and automatically if we have two numbers and if we able to find the gcd we can sure shot find the lcm that's it so let's code it we have to find gcd first so gcd of two number that is a and b and as we know that if b equal equal to 0 we return a means our gcd is a but if it is not true then we recursively call the function gcd and we return b comma a mod b that's it so this is a gcd function now what is LCM function? LCM of A comma LCM of V. So LCM of two numbers says int result is equal to simply we have to multiply A into B and we have to divide it by GCD of A comma B. That's it. So this is our and we have to print result so this is simple code so just take the example that is gcd of 9 into 6 what we are getting actually let's run the code So 18 as we know the LCM of 9 that is 3 into 3 we are getting so I'll uh, write down here a dry run that is what is actually happening so 3 into 3 into 3 that is 9 and second number is 3 into 2 so 3 is common means HCF is 3 and if we divide it HCF then we get 3 into 3 into 2 that is 3 into 3 is 9 into 2 is 18 
so our lcm is 18 so as per function and also the methodology we are getting correct answer so that's it so stay tuned for upcoming videos regarding machine learning and all other algorithms so stay blessed thank you like share subscribe